Hi, I'm Bill from CJ Pony Parts. The Roush axle back was one of the more popular systems for the 2011 through 2014 Coyotes, especially if you're keeping the rest of your exhaust system stock. It offered a very aggressive tone when on the throttle, but at highway speeds it was very tame and offered no drone at all. When Roush announced a similar system for the 2015 Mustang, we knew we had to get our hands on one. So today we're going to show you how to install one of your 2015 Mustang, and we'll provide you some sound clips. Unlike the previous models, any axle back on the 2015 Mustang will require cutting, which actually isn't that big of a deal. The system comes with everything you need for installation, including the two mufflers, which are full stainless steel, along with these two chrome 4-inch tips. Before we get started with the installation, we're going to play you some sound clips of a factory 2015 GT exhaust. For this installation, you'll need a lift or a jack and jack stands, half inch ratchet or low torque electric half inch impact gun, 15 millimeter socket, sawzall, file, marker, and safety glasses. Like I said, with any axle back system, you're going to have to cut. Previous models would have clamps in this neighborhood. In the case of the 15s, everything is welded. The cutting really is no big deal. The instructions from Rouse are very clear on where to cut. So you want to mark it over here, I'll explain where you're actually going to mark it, and then you can cut it. The instructions provided by Roush tell you to cut the pipe closest to the tangent of the curve. If you're like me, you probably read more car magazines and didn't pay attention to geometry class, I'll explain what the tangent is. What that is, is the closest straight line to the curve of the pipe. So you want to follow the curve over, and as soon as it gets to a straight section, that's roughly where you're going to cut. And do the same thing on both sides. To make sure you're in the right neighborhood, grab the Roush muffler, you're gonna hold it up approximately where it's gonna go, and then make sure this lines up with where you're gonna cut. Everything looks good so we can cut the pipe. Since you'll need two hands to control the saw, if you don't have someone to hold the pipes for you, stuff some rags up in here, that way it doesn't bounce up against your balance. Now we can slide the muffler off the factory hanger. Now you want to deburr it before we put the new pipe on. First slide the clamp over our muffler. Make sure it's a spot where you can reach it to tighten it. And put it up into the hanger. and slot it over the factory pipe. Now grab the supplied tips, which are fully adjustable in this case. Slide a clamp on. And then you get it where you want it. You can push it all the way down and bottom and out, but usually like a little bit better pulled out a little bit. Let's go back and tighten everything down. Now, Roush recommends against using an air impact for this part of the job. As soon as a hand tool or, like I said, I have a low torque impact gun, which is electric, which will work fine. I'm going to repeat the process on the other side. All right, it fits great. Let's see how it sounds. Sounds killer. It's the same aggressive sound we got from the older Roush system. Sounds just as good on the 15.
Inside the car, the tone is very similar to the 11 through 14. It has that same kind of aggressive sound to it, but it's quieter. I actually don't think the exhaust is quieter. It's just the 15 is actually much quieter inside. So I think it's deading a lot of the sound out. When you're at highway speeds, we're doing 65 right now. Can't even hear it. No drone, no nothing at all. You down should get on it though. Has that nice aggressive sound we're used to from Roush mufflers. That Roush sound that was so popular with 11 through 14 is alive and well for the 15 too. It sounds nice and aggressive when you get on it, but on the highway it's real mild and no drone whatsoever. Insulation is also pretty straightforward, probably take you only around an hour. The best selection of 2015 Mustang parts, make sure you check out cjponyparts.com. For more install videos like this, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel.